Welcome to BT Travel. I'm your host, Sabrina, here to guide you on all things Barbadian and vacation. Today is all about a Bajan favorite, yellow meat breadfruit. Wondering what that is? Well, stay tuned to find out. Let's go. At Yellow Meat, you will experience delicious Bajan cuisine, mouth-watering dishes carefully prepared with fresh ingredients using traditional techniques. So we're here with Kim, one of the co-founders of Yellow Meat here on Black Rock Main Road. Kim, tell us about the inceptions and the, you know the reason behind you guys started Yellow Meat. Okay, so we first got started, um, we were in an entrepreneurship class mm -hmm. together and one of the assignments was to create a product or business based on heritage tourism. Oh! And we came up with the idea of conceptualizing and commercializing, sorry, roast mm -hmm. bread fruit. Ah. Um, so we had a sale day. At first it was just to kind of showcase to tourists mm -hmm. what we have to offer here in Barbados mm -hmm. and the locals absolutely loved it and um, we just kind of ran with that. Uh -huh. uh, before we, we kind of actually packaged it a lot different. After class, uh, myself and Dwight and a couple others of us got together and actually said, you know what, I think we can actually create a business out of this. Mm -hmm. And in the car part of us at class one day, Dwight and myself was kind of bouncing ideas off each other. And I was like, you know, we're not giving people the true essence of how we in Barbados eat roast breadfruit. Mm -hmm. Actually being able to see the charcoal of that breadfruit and the butter inside. Yes. And we birthed what is now called the breadfruit bowl. Yes. Which is our flagship product here in Yalami. Yes, yes, yeah. yes. So for those of those out there who actually don't know, one, breadfruit. And what exactly is yellow meat breadfruit? Okay, so a yellow meat breadfruit is one of the most preferred um, variations of breadfruit. There are actually 26 varieties of breadfruit. Wow. <laughs> um, yep. In Barbados, we only have two kinds though. We have a yellow meat or one that's predominantly uh, of a whiter yeah. flesh. So the yellow meat is basically just the flesh inside is mm -hmm. very ri ripe and yellow mm -hmm. and it's a sweeter taste. Ah. So that's the one that everyone prefers. So obviously that kind of goes back with our name. Yellow exactly. <laughs> so the best of the mm -hmm. bright fruit, mm -hmm. yellow meat. Yep. I love it, love it, love it. Yep. Tell us a little bit about the menu and your most popular, which I've tried, mm -hmm. but tell <laughs> us a little bit some of the other options you guys have. All right, so um, with our toppings, we wanted to keep it like very traditional. Mm -hmm. um, even when we started out, we had people in different parishes saying, oh, in St. Lucy, we eat this with our bread fruit, ah. or St. Peter, we eat this with our bread fruit. So we kind of put all of those things together. Um, so on our menu, you can find tuna gravy, corned beef, we have red herring, nice. um, we have bojol, we have pickle pigtail, which is popular. That's the favorite. Everybody comes for our pickle pigtail. <laughs> um, and then we have new additions on the menu. We have a jerk chicken bowl as well. Ooh. And we jerk our chicken here um, in our jerk pan. Mm -hmm. So we do lots of traditional outdoor cooking with wood, you know, that kind of stuff mm -hmm. to kind of keep it very traditional. It yeah. is very authentic. I love that about Thank it. You. I also see that you guys do not just toppings on bread fruit. You actually take the Bajan Sunday lunch and you put it in the bread fruit bowl. Yeah. Is that correct? <laughs> yeah. Um, even um, options like lamb stew, black belly lamb, yeah. you know that kind of stuff. We also put on our on our bread. Fruit oh, bowls. lovely, lovely. And then recently um, we have added. We do bread fruit tacos as well. Yes. Um, we do yam poppers, which is similar to like a fish cake, mm -hmm. but instead of using flour, we use yam. The consistency is a bit different, mm -hmm. but you know the the concept is kind of the same. It has salt fish, it mm -hmm. has the herbs, that kind of stuff, and we pair it with our pepper sauce. Um, we also do breadfruit wedges, Ooh. and we do a ground provision. <laughs> So we do a ground provision nachos as well, which is very thinly sliced, breadfruit, sweet potato, plantain, all together, and then you could add your toppings on top. So still kind of keep it very homey, very traditional, but just kind of giving it a lift. I'm blown away by the tacos and the nachos you talked about in terms of taking what was once, you know, granny's old way of having food, the ground provisions, and now you've made it into something new, but still keeping that, yeah. you know, that core of Barbados yeah, at heart. That is sure. absolutely great. Yeah, Definitely. So everybody loves a bread fruit bowl at yeah. Barbados. I'll be looking forward to some crop over events mm -hmm. we with have a, a bread fruit bowl. Yeah, we'll coming up. Oh, nice. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, guys.
So we are about to try a little bit of the breadfruit bowl and let you guys see what it's like. So this is our bowl chow bowl with mala cream butter, of course. Mm. <laughs> For those who don't know, just let me just give a quick description. Mala cream is just a form of... It's margarine, uh -huh. but in Barbados, we call everything butter. Yes! <laughs> it goes really, really good with, um, with breadfruit. That's mm -hmm. what everybody eats. With mm -hmm. a roast breadfruit and mala cream, you can't go wrong. Cannot go wrong. <laughs> but for today, it's all about the mellow cream, breadfruit, and bull gel. Taste test right here on camera. We got the bull gel, which is salted fish. I learned not to call it um, cod because it's not always cod. And the mellow cream. Let me show you guys the mellow cream. This thing yellow. Both the breadfruit and the mellow cream yellow. Mm. Mm. Mm -mm. Wow. That bread, bread fruit is sweet. Yellow meat bread fruit. It hits the spot. Awesome. Kim? Mm -hmm. Thank you for keeping You're welcome. Barbados alive. Oh, thank you. In this very innovative thank you. and creative way. As always, guys, <laughs> stay safe and enjoy life. I'm going to go and enjoy this bowl, and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. <laughs>